I, they hired the me as a goblin number hobgoblin. 14, yeah. <laughs> Fortunately, I was taller than the rest of the goblins, and it just didn't work out. Is that all your questions? Is that? Oh, I, I, I'm the worst interviewer of all time. Stand by for speed. We're, we're ready to roll. I only get like four minutes. That's true. How much can you ask? Unless you don't talk, if you okay, answer yes or no questions, then we're all in trouble. We're I ready. promise I'll do that. Yeah, you promise? Yeah. Thank you so much. Just like. Yeah. Okay. So, are we rolling? We're rolling. Okay. Now, Mallory is, I don't know how to say this, she's kind of a bossy sister. Would you say, so were you acting or are you in fact a bossy sister yourself? No, Mallory is like a real strong, confident right. girl. She's bossy, yeah. Cause, I mean, she's two right. younger brothers. I have only, I have um, one younger sister and I'm not too bad. You're not too bossy? I have my moments, I'm not too bad. Well, I actually don't believe you and I'm now commencing movie court. I call my first witness, Emma Bolger. Emma Bolger, will you please come here? Hello. Emma, come right here, please. Here. Emma, uh, do you swear to tell the truth, the whole truth, nothing but the truth to help you guide? I do. Will you please identify the person right in front of you right now? This is Sarah Bolger. And what is your relationship with this young woman in front of us? Sister. Has she ever been bossy in your life? Yes. Yes, so you would say that she's a very bossy sister. Very bossy might be a bit, you know. Yeah. And would you say that she wasn't acting then in the movie, she was just playing herself? Yes, apart from the fencing, yes. I yeah. object. This uh, objection overruled. <laughs> you are guilty. Your punishment is you will do Emma's bed for two days. You will make her bed. Thank you, Emma. Get away from me. Go away. Right. Thank you so much. Court is out of session. So you, no, you started off lying to me, which is not a good way to start. I'm sorry. Pardon me. I am bossy sometimes. Okay. All right. Thank you very much for that answer. Now, <laughs> let's talk about what I think would probably be the most fun day on the entire set. Uh, getting Hobgoblin spit thrown on you. Oh, yeah. What was that gook? Oh, it was like, um, you know, petroleum jelly kind of a Vaseline kind of thing with um, food coloring. It was, it was gross. And I have to say, it took me about 20 sh it takes to do it because I stood there and I was like, I kept squinting every time they say action. And you were supposed to look like you, yeah, it wasn't coming in. Yeah, anymore. I was terrible. So what did they do? They had to just dry you up in between and then go in her? It was everywhere, actually. I mean, we kept having, it was only from my neck up, so you couldn't see my top. But it was absolutely, like, drenched in this yeah. gook. Uh, I was mad because I can't imagine they'd get the first take right in your eyes. Every yeah, no, time, I was so. no good I mean, at that. Sometimes I think that would be dangerous. You know what I mean? Don't you, you want your sight? I need my sight. You know what I mean? So Now, you're kind of becoming the action chick here because the last couple of movies we saw you hanging from a building and, then, building. and now you're doing uh, some fighting and sword thing like this. And I didn't know you had any uh, sword play skills. I trained. I seriously trained for this movie. And yeah. um, it was actually a lot of fun to do. But do you think you're, you would keep something up like that? Or is that something that's very disciplined? Because you were actually doing it. I actually believe that you were, uh, you know. Well, thank what, you very what do you much. Call someone who does a sword thing? Was it like a... I uh, know, fencer? Fencing? A fencer. So I don't know but there's a word like a fence. I don't know if there's a word for that or anything like that. I have no idea. Mallory, let's just call her Mallory for the Mallory? Yeah. Mallory. Do you know what? It was it's very disciplined. You know, it's quite, they asked me do you do ballet actually before I started training because you just need the posture and that's right. the main thing to get. It's not so much the moves. It's like the Is that the is that the cool thing about acting though you're finding is you get I mean not only do you have to portray like you, in this movie you had to cry you had to do all stuff yeah. but you actually had to do it like I said learn Yeah there's like a skill. skill. Yeah. yeah like um for Stormbreaker I did horse riding which was yeah. fun. And then for this it's fencing. So like by the end of like my lifespan I'll be like really good at everything. And I have to end with uh cuz I'm simply in love with Mary Louise Parker. Uh, tell me something please is she nice? Is she I don't know, I never met her. She's wonderful. Really? Absolutely wonderful. I mean she was on set. She wasn't on set for the whole uh, for the um entire movie but when she was on set she was just she was great I mean every lunchtime we were in her trailer myself and Freddie she's she's fantastic well, you're absolutely wonderful in this film and thank uh, you very much so proud of you you're awesome